Yeah, but dabba YouTube, what's up boys and girls, it's your boy Zockstar. Once again, coming at you with another Pinoy 1000 cash giveaway. That's right guys, it is the month of May and it's time to run another Pinoy 1000 cash giveaway. Uh, I just want to apologise for this last month. I haven't been um, doing much on, um, <clears throat> on the internet um, due to this um, problem we have going. Uh, a lot of people are in lockdown, as I'm sure most of you are, and uh, due to that, my work has been extremely busy. I've been working seven days a week, 12 hours a day, and by the time I get home and try and do something, I just don't have the energy. I, I barely can walk when I get home. So I come home, have a quick shower, have something to eat, and literally in the bed. Um, I, you might notice I'm uploading music videos. Um, I normally upload about two or three weeks worth, sometimes even a month's worth, all in one day. And then at um, certain intervals of the day, I have them uh, scheduled to upload or to go from private to public. So um, that's the only way I've been able to get these music videos up. I like to put something up every day and um, Hoping that this will increase the uh, subscriber count, but it doesn't seem to be working. Um, I'm hoping that if I can get some of these giveaways going again, that might help me get back into the um, growing stage. I just got home. Today's a, today was a bit early. I finished off a bit, a bit earlier. I got home. I've had a shower. Wife's cooking something for me now, so I thought I'd try and put one of these giveaways out for the month of May. Now first I want to congratulate the previous winner from I believe it was March, Vanessa. Um, I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Is it Gos, Gose, Gossi? I'm not quite sure how to pronounce that. Excuse me if I've, if I've got that wrong. But Vanessa, I just want to let you know, don't worry, the money is still there. I'm just waiting for you to come out of lockdown so I can send you that money. Um, I do realise that the Philippines is um, in a pretty severe lockdown. Um, we are here too in Australia. We've, we're in stage three lockdown. Uh, most of the restaurants, gyms, um, large places of gatherings, they've all been locked down, they're closed. You can't go there, you can't do anything there. The malls are open. Uh, some shops are still remaining to be open, but when there's no customers, it's pretty much useless to be open. Um, <clears throat> the grocery stores are open. They're the essential, they call that essential items. Um, I'm not sure whether you've seen any videos coming out from Australia, but it got pretty bad here about a month ago. Uh, people were fighting to get toilet paper. Crazy, I know. Um, and not only that, it was the hand sanitizer, um, certain foods like pasta, rice, all sold out. You couldn't even get like one little bag of pasta or even one kilo of rice, the sugar, the flour, canned goods, the tuna, the fish, the beans. You, it was absolutely crazy, but things have slowed down a bit now. Uh, Australia seems to have flattened the curve, as they say. Um, so they're already talking about lifting some of the restrictions, I believe, next week. Um, so we're yet to, yet to see or yet to hear what those um, restrictions are going to be like once they lift some of them. Um, only time will tell. Um, uh, so let's get straight into this. Um, um, as you all know, to be eligible for these giveaways, you must... Pretty much the number one rule of this giveaway is you must be subscribed to my YouTube channel. Number two, you must follow me on Instagram. And number three, which sort of relates to number four, if you saw the little thing in the front of this video, um, the winner has to receive, or the recipient or the winner has to be living in the Philippines. When I send this money, I'm going to be sending it to the Philippines, somewhere in the Philippines, and it's going to be in pesos. So that's pretty much it. So if you have friends that live outside of the Philippines but 
would like to send it to someone in the Philippines, then they are eligible to enter these this giveaway as long as they subscribe to you to my YouTube channel and they follow me on Instagram. That's pretty much it. Um, so there you have it. Um, I've seen a lot of videos coming out of the Philippines and. Things are different these days. No more people going around wherever they want, vlogging and traveling. Um, it looks like it's pretty serious there, and so it should be. Um, I don't know how long this is gonna last. Um, it all comes down to, as they say, flattening the curve. The, the, the less um, new cases places have, less deaths they have, then things can start to look a bit better. Uh, but until that happens, looks like we're all stuck at home. I'm not stuck at home, I actually work, so does my wife. Um, <clears throat> but as I said, certain um, businesses have been closed down and they're in complete lockdown. Um, a lot of uh, office workers and staff, they've all been sent home to work from home. Um, but certain businesses, if they can, they will remain open. We just have to practice that social distancing I work in a bobcat, I'm by myself, so I pretty much I'm social distancing very well. Um, during our breaks, we all stand within two to three meters of each other and we seem to be controlling that social distancing pretty well. And apart from that, um, that is pretty much it. As I said, I've been working seven days a week. You might sort of see some bags under my eyes. Um, I'm not getting that much sleep. <coughs> Um, seven days a week, 12 hours a day, puts a toll on the body. Um, yesterday I rolled my ankle, so today things were a little bit slower and I just had to go home, the pain was too much to bear, so I, I came home a bit early. Um, so yeah, there you have it. All right guys, so we're gonna run this Pinoy 1000 for May, and for this one, I just wanna find out are you working? Are you not working? How have you been affected? Um, tell me anything. Anything. The answer to this will be anything what you want to tell me about uh, for what you've been doing or what's up with your lives in the last month. How has this affected you? Um, are you coping? Is everyone okay? Anyone struggling? Um, I know it's not a good time for most people. Um, we're all humans. We prefer not to be locked locked away. Um, some people I've heard feels like they're in jail, they're not allowed to go out, they're not allowed to do nothing. They can't visit their friends, they can't visit their parents, they they just can't go out. Here in Australia we're, we're not even allowed, we, you can only go out if you go for exercise, uh, medical, groceries and work. Um, that's if your work is still open. Uh, but for everyone else you have to stay home. Um, a lot of people have been trying to go to the beach but our beaches have been closed. No one is allowed to go to any beach anywhere all over Australia. So it's been pretty hard. So I know what it's like. I'm a, I'm a creature of comfort. I don't mind this. To tell you the truth, I'm loving it. Um, when I go to, when, when the, me and my wife go and do our groceries, it's quiet. There's no queues. You're in, you're out. Um, the traffic, awesome. Loving this, not much traffic in the mornings, not much traffic in the evenings, there's just less people around, which I, I prefer. Um, I've seen videos from the Philippines in Manila and that, it's a ghost town. So, I don't know, I don't know what that feels like. If you were there and, you, and you're in my position where you can move about going to work and come back, it's probably a good thing, I'm not sure. But um, yeah, let me know. Tell me what's happening in your life um, <clears throat> over the last four weeks and that should be enough. Uh, so um, I will finish it off on that. Um, as you all know, put your name, the answers, or what's been happening in your life, and put your Instagram name on the bottom so I can tell if you're following me on Instagram and if I can contact you if you are the winner. So that's pretty much it. Um, you might see me looking a bit orange or red. Um, one of my lights here died <coughs> just this morning. I was trying to, you know, move things around and I moved this little light lamp and seems to have killed the light. I came home this, uh, this evening, turned it on, 
and it wasn't working properly, it's blown a light. So I put the old one in that came with it when I bought it, and it's one of those, one of those spotlights, sort of like an incandescent light, it's sort of, it's got that orangey sort of look compared to the one I've got up here, which is a bright white, so you might see me looking like I'm sunburned or something, but I assure you, I'm not sunburned, it's just the light. Anyway, that's it, my friends. Um, don't forget to tell your friends about the Pinoy 1000, uh, especially the Pinoy 1000 May cash giveaway. It's running, it's going, and it's gonna go off at the end of the month, so tell all your friends, help me to help you in the future. That's all I'm asking for. I'm not asking for any money. I just need your help to get my subscribers up so I can live out my dream of doing what I do best and that's helping others. Um, I have chosen the Philippines because it's, I hold the dear to my, my heart. My wife comes from there. I love the Philippines. I love the Filipino people and I just want to do more. I can't do it at the moment because I'm not rich, I don't have millions of dollars like some people, um, <clears throat> some people have millions of dollars and they still don't help anyone, but if I can achieve my goals of um, obtaining a large subscriber following on YouTube, then hopefully one day I can move to the Philippines and show you, show you guys what I'm really capable of with my generous heart. So, until we see each other at the end of this month with the winner for the May giveaway. Um, stay strong, be safe, peace out. Side. I don't want to waste what's left